Funeral arrangements are being finalized for Congressman Bill Pascrell Jr., who died on Wednesday at the age of 87. He was a giant figure in New Jersey politics, and his family, friends, and colleagues mourn his death. Democrats are facing a crucial deadline to pick a successor to replace him on the ballot. Christine Sloan covers New Jersey and has the story tonight from Patterson. In Patterson at City Hall, a lowered flag and purple bunting to honor the late Congressman Bill Pascrell Jr., who died after a month-long illness. Pascrell was once the mayor of this city, and residents, especially union workers, have fond memories of him. He's very instrumental in helping us get a contract and all that, so he was, he was always there. Uh, we lost a fighter in New Jersey. And I feel like he did it just like Frank Sinatra. He did it his way. Assemblywoman Shavonda Sumter was close to the congressman and spoke to me from Chicago, where she's attending the Democratic National Convention. Right now, of course, we extend love to the family, which we have been doing uh, since he was first hospitalized. Political sources tell me Sumter is a leading choice among Democrats to replace Pascrell on the ballot. So are Patterson's Mayor Andre Saya, State Senator Nellie Poe, and Bergen County Commissioner Tracy Silna Zor. If I am fortunate enough to have the opportunity to again compete for the congressional seat, it would be my absolute honor to continue the work and the legacy of the late congressman. In Pascrell's district, political sources tell me Democratic committee chairpersons in three counties will meet Wednesday to finalize successor names for hundreds of members to vote on that night. And I've lived in Patterson, New Jersey my entire life. Billy Prempe is the Republican candidate running for the seat. He says he's praying for Pascrell's family, but says of the Democrats, quote, it doesn't matter who they select. What is destroying the lives of residents of the 9th District and the entire United States are the horrible policies they force on all of us. Sumter says Pascrell's contributions are vast. I still get a little emotional for taking time for us to reflect on his memory and his work because he deserves that for all that he has given to the great state of New Jersey and the country. And the deadline is tight. Democrats have until Thursday to submit a name to the state to be placed on the November ballot. In Patterson, New Jersey, Christine Sloan, CBS News, New York.